Hey guys, it's me Kuya Jeff and today I'm gonna show you how to change your transfer case fluid It's gonna be similar to the rear uh, differential so it's pretty easy anyone can do it especially you So stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe and let's change the fluid so let's go Okay guys so first I need to remove my skid plate because it's kind of like blocking the the drain and the fill holder so since I don't have the the stock bumper so there's no plastic uh, cover underneath so I have to remove the skid plate so let me just uh, jack it up and remove it all right guys so once I success successfully remove the, the skid plate next it's pretty easy just find the what do you call that the transfer case and we're just gonna drain it and that's it so let me just crawl over but let me just get my bucket so for the gear oil so it's gonna be like a 75w90 gear oil so I got two different brand here so it's gonna be like the same thing anyway I've been using this too for like well my car is kind of like a 1,600 1, miles on it now so I change it every 30 miles on it since I'm gonna change my trans fluid, uh, transmission fluid so I might as well change my transfer case also so yeah so that's bubbling and master pro so since i don't have, can't find this anymore i'm gonna use this master pro 75w90 gear oil all right guys so next we're gonna drain the the transfer case fluid so what i'm gonna do uh for me what i'm doing that i'm gonna un unplug the the fill hole and then after that i uh unplug the i mean unbolt the the drain hole so at least it's gonna be all the way out I mean the, the fluid is gonna go all the way out so let me just do that right now I'm using one hand so and prepare your bucket so you want to make a mess but let me just do the the fill hole first okay so it's gonna be right over there yeah. okay Oh, that's loose take it out okay once it once it's out next it's gonna be the drain hole so it's pretty much easy to do this anyone can do this so all right then just write your bucket so you won't make a mess all right now make a mess so there you go yep so just let it drain and on there so i have some a special tool to fill that i'm gonna show it to you guys later on so after after we completely drain this so yeah all right guys so this is my special tool so it's um, a syringe so i just like you know suck it in and then suck it out to the transfer case so it's for me it's pretty easy it's kind of like a five fill with this and that's it or five or six i don't remember anymore so like i said just suck it in like that as you can see the fluids coming in and after that fill it up there so it's pretty easy guys all right just put it in there and then just push it it's pretty easy guys it's pretty easy there you go and then we can just suck it in again It's all good now guys it's all filled up so we're just gonna put the 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 fill hole uh, bolt and then after that we're just gonna just a little bit clean it up and that's pretty much it just clean it up just type it up I mean tight it up <laughs> that's it guys 
that's how you change the uh, transmission fluid on the Toyota RAV4 um, this I think I guess this is the fifth gen Toyota RAV4 so this for the gas version not the hybrid portion or the electric version so like I said it's pretty easy once you take off the cover it's pretty easy so it's right over there and this is one is the transmission fluid and then you know the oil and pretty much easy so clean it up and that's it all right guys so i hope you like this video and i hope it's uh helpful for you if you want to do uh changing your transfer case uh fluids and yeah and don't forget to so to like share and subscribe and yeah and i see you for the next DUI or repair uh video like this so peace out guys